Hi everybody, it's Travel Gene 1981 here. It is Sunday, uh, what did it say? Sunday, May 13th, 2018. Happy Mother's Day to everyone, all the new mothers, all the mothers, the grandmothers, soon-to-be mothers. Happy Mother's Day. So what we are here today is for another review. And what do we have here? We have Z. Bag. What should I call the bag? Uh, the bag from Cost Plus. So, as you can tell, I have lots of goodies here. I bought them all at once, and I'm like, this is the bag that I'll choose a random item to do a review on. So, let's see. Let's see what's in store for today's review. Oh, ooh, okay. So what we have today is another Sipling Gum Mints, and this is Ginger. Ginger? I know, Ginger. Who would have said, who have heard of Ginger Mints? But, you know, being Chinese, we do have uh, Ginger Candy, and it's like a soft candy. I'm not sure if you, if you ever had... Um, Asian candy, they have white rabbit candy. I don't think I've ever done a review of white rabbit candy, but it's a chewy candy, vanilla kind of flavored. Um, this They have a ginger candy, sort of the same concept, Chinese. But it was pretty interesting that they have a mint ginger flavor. Uh, this is from Simply Gum again. They have a wide range of different flavored mints and gum. Uh... As in my bag, I have different flavors. I just pick them up randomly, and I just want, I guess, uh, today we're going to do some Simply Gum Mints ginger flavor. Uh, like I said, this is a product of Canada uh, before. Um, ingredients, cane sugar, ground ginger root, ginger extract, and calcium stearate. Uh, yeah, Simply Gum Mints. It's supposed to be kosher, uh, gluten-free, I think. Um, so yeah, let's get right to it. It's, <coughs> excuse me. <sighs> Kirkland water. So anyways, it is wrapped up nice and tight, plastic. Let's, uh, open this up as best as we can without scratching the tin can. I like these tin cans. If you, ever, if you saw my previous video, I used to have the, the mints. Which is already depleted, but it was really good. So we're gonna try the ginger flavor mints. I'm kind of uh, nervous because when I have Chinese um, ginger candy, it is sort of like um, a ginseng kind of uh, taste. Mm, not appetizing, but <coughs> let's see what this does. All right. No distinct smell. It's like it's yeah, no distinct smell from outside. Let's look what inside. What if it's the same color as a really uh, of, of mint? You know, let's open it up. Okay, so these are like I said, these mints look like certs. I think my previous video I did not link or put an image of certs, which I'll do on this video. Um, but you can tell these mints are actually a different color. They're kind of a light brown color. You can't really see it that well under this light, but yeah, from my perspective, my view, it is like a light brown color. So, let's see, get a better view like that. Nope, not really. Looks white all the same. But, let's do an initial smell test. Does it smell too much minty? Yeah, uh, I can't really smell the ginger. Yeah. Well, we're, we're going to try this out anyways.
Just uh, some initial, initial reactions is that when you put it in your mouth, it takes a little while to dissolve. But I definitely can feel that sharp kind of taste. Every time you have like a ginseng candy or, well, ginseng candy in general, uh, they always have that sh it's kind of a sharp taste. It's like eating a Sour Patch Kids with the, the sour coming in first and then the sweetness overtaking it later. Same thing as with this ginger mint. No, not too, not too much minty, more of a, it feels like eating one of those ginseng candies. <coughs> they have the squishy ones, and they also have the ones, like, uh, candy-wise, you know, hard-based. And, and, and this reminds me of it. Well, I bit into it, and it does have a sharp, unique ginger taste, even aftertaste. Reminds me of those I mint mean candy, of uh, those ginger candies, which I'll try, I'll try, I'll try to find and do a review as well. So that's that's my that that is my um, opinion about this ginger mint. I don't think it's something I would buy. Um, again, but, uh, it is a ginger mint, and, um, yeah. <coughs> they have their own website, simplygum.com. Yeah. I'll list everything down below. Uh, please check out my other videos of my mints, my gums, Breath mints, uh, breath fresheners. I have a playlist dedicated to that. Uh, if you definitely want to try this uh, flavor out, uh, check your local uh, grocery store, uh, Target, Walmart. Um, I'm pretty sure your Target and Walmart might have it, not your local grocery store. Uh, if you live in California, look for Cost Plus. I'm not sure if it's nationwide, but do you check the website? They do have a website worldmarket.com. I'll leave all the information down below for you to check it out. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Share with other people that you know. Uh, tell them about my my videos and be sure to uh, uh, watch out for some more videos coming up. Um, should have every weekend a new uh, review. Uh, and then one time during the week, unannounced, I'll have a video as well so if you click that subscribe button and click on the alert button the alert button will let you know when a new video has been popped up so this is travel g1981 here signing off and again happy mother's day see ya